Hello, everybody. I'm Heather Hayes. And I'm Steve Eager. Good evening. Arlington Police investigating a mother's complaint about the way an officer took her two teenage sons into custody. The mother started recording the confrontation after her 14-year-old was already being detained. The incident happened July 3rd in an apartment complex where police were called about a car burglary. Police say the 14-year-old matched the suspect description given to the officers. The video is getting attention 10 days later now because an activist group posted the clip on Facebook. Phil Alvarado first on Fox 4 News in Arlington with more on the investigation. Phil. Hi, Steve. Well, Latasha Nelson says she began rolling video of her encounter with Arlington police after they had already detained one of her sons. Uh, she describes the beginning as a polite enough exchange between her and the officer, considering uh, he's handcuffed her 14-year-old son, Trayvon, who was suspected of burglarizing a car, uh, but with the encounter uh, turned much more confrontational, as uh, Nelson persistently demanded to know where her son was being taken. Uh, the officer called for backup after putting uh, Trayvon in one police car, uh, then, as he and Nelson are arguing, something causes him to take down the woman's 16-year-old son. You're going to give me your information and let me know where you're taking my son, okay, because he's 14 years old, and you're not going to take my son. Have my officers en route code. I have a I mother out here that's interfering son. in your investigation. I'm not interfering in your family you investigation, but you're not going to take my Shit. son from me. Hey. Don't you just grab my oh. son hey, like stop. that. Not, How you just going to sit here and grab my son? Like stop, that. Stop. Hey, hey, stop. Come on. Just step back. How is you just sitting here doing my child like that? He is 16 years old. And you just slapped him in his face? Uh, the family says Broderick was arrested for interfering with the officer. What we can't tell from the video is whether he is approaching the officer from behind or made any physical contact with him. Uh, Nelson, uh, with her two sons beside her, uh, spoke about the video today and her complaint that the officer would not tell her where her son was being taken. When you sit here and tell me you're going to take my son somewhere and not let me know, this it didn't have to escalate like that. Nelson says she filed a, a use of force complaint for the way her sons were taken into custody. She says neither of her sons has been formally charged with any crimes. Arlington police have not commented on camera, but released a statement saying that they take seriously any allegations of misconduct and are thoroughly investigating what's on the video along with a statement from the family. Now, police say that they have referred this case to Internal Affairs for a complete investigation. In the meantime, uh, that officer remains on duty. Stephen Heather. All right, Phil Alvarado at Arlington Police Headquarters and uh, City Hall. Phil, thanks.